Good day and welcome back to the channel everybody. This is Armin's High Life. We do videos of firewood, tree jobs, and a bit of outdoor exploring. In today's video, we are in the wood yard here. It is a, it's a little chilly out today. We are keeping warm though by splitting up our odds and ends or slash boiler wood. We got a pretty decent pile going on here. I'm gonna see if we can uh, heat up our drone to see if we can get a... Well, let alone that uh, drone going up in the sky that day, it was just too cold. Our phone gave out uh, pretty much right there. Uh, unfortunately, uh, that's what happens though when you're dealing with these really cold temperatures here in Alberta. It is quite a bit of a nicer day today though. We are, I think we got up to like plus two today. So just a beautiful day. So we've been uh, still gathering up and uh, just kept on splitting. We got our new ax handle on finally. I love this uh, ax head. Uh, I came out, I got it quite a good uh, collection for anyone you all for anyone that's new on the channel of uh, axes and uh, a lot of them are uh, older antique ones nothing really uh, that's got kind of that beefy head on there but uh, this is our uh, seven pound axe head that we had uh, made up there uh, last year ish sometime like around there we gave one away too on the channel once we hit a thousand subscribers but it's uh, one of my best axes I have to say like, but I brought out uh, one of our some of our uh, skinnier axes there. Try to split up some of this wood, and uh, with it being pretty knotty, like some of these pieces, as you guys can see, you got some pretty gross knots in them. The axe there, it just uh, pretty much got stuck in there. It, we spent more time uh, wiggling in that thing, try to get it out and then hit the next smack, compared to uh, this bigger seven pound, seven pound head. This thing just goes through it like butter. Uh, sometimes it bounces off, but uh, it doesn't really get stuck that much. And uh, with that much weight, she just splits right through some of those knots. It just goes like crazy. Definitely got to get the right axe for the right job when you're splitting uh, wood. Probably uh, some of those harder woods you might want to, I don't know if this thing would work exactly on them. But uh, for pine, pine and spruce that uh, get pretty knotty. Love this axe. One of my favorite axes in my collection though. But uh, yeah, we got her all new handled up. Uh, nothing really fancy put on there. We still got to give that a little scrape down and then maybe we might give it a burn job. But uh, we still got a little tack there at the bottom. Three days worth it and uh, she's splitting beautifully. It's been nice uh, having that going again though. But uh, in our yard though, we are getting quite filled up. We have enough room for another two loads worth of logs just before we start hitting the pile of uh, our boiler wood. And then on the other side, we're gonna be going right up to that fence post. So we could probably get another uh, three or four truckloads worth of odds and ends in here. And then from that rest down, we're probably gonna have pre-measured out uh, quarter cords just for yard pickups this summertime. We're uh, planning on opening up our yard more often last year and the pole quite a few of these years i try to keep the gates closed and uh try to keep the yard uh traffic to a minimum although people do like to stop by here when i'm working in here but this year we're going to try to open it up a bit more add a little bit of signage so uh that should hopefully attract a little more of the camper local campers to come in here and just uh quickly grab a load save on a little bit of delivery fees on our end and uh wear and tear on our truck although uh with all these logs She's got enough wear and tear. But uh, I just want to show you guys that. Uh, unfortunately, that yeah, other day there, like I said, with the video uh, kind of cut out there, a little unfortunate, but uh, that's what happens when you're dealing with these kind of cold winter days. But we will talk to you guys again uh, later on this week. Thanks for tuning in to Arms High Life. Bye, guys. <music>